Well, now on your feet at five, it's been a record year for the U.S. Postal Service. A historic amount of packages and staffing shortages due to the pandemic led to a slowdown of deliveries this holiday season. Many Ohioans are still waiting on their Christmas gifts to arrive. Amani Abraham shares an update from the Postal Service on their progress to bring packages to their final destination. The number of packages being sent out this year nationwide stands at around 3 billion, a 30 percent increase from last year. The heavy volume meant some people had to deal with long delays. Wasn't there in time to put under the tree. Zach Geyser, who's related to a WKYC employee, says he purchased a gift for his nephew on Cyber Monday. He got an update that it was shipped on December 6, but he says it didn't arrive until this past weekend. Another punch to roll with in 2020. I mean, just something that is out of our hands, out of our control, um, and and something you just have to accept at this point. Earlier today, trucks were actively in and out of the main post office in Cleveland. The Postal Service says since November, the Cleveland and Akron processing plants have hired more than 500 people for the holiday season. But with the pandemic, Mary Sitko, head of the Postal Workers Union in Akron, says they have faced some staffing challenges. We also get sick, and so not only are we hiring people to assist us, we have to take into consideration the people, the employees that do become ill. Today in a statement, a Postal Service spokesperson said, quote, we continue to flex our network, including making sure the right equipment is available to sort, process, and deliver a historic volume of mail and packages. The Postal Service goes on to say that the leadership team is working with unions and the management associations to help address some of these concerns and get those remaining and future packages delivered. Amani Abraham, 3 News.